In this final slide, I would like to show you how to use Chuck Norris to kick off your slide. We are arriving at the conclusion of our presentation and I'm adding the last slide for now, which will be the exit slide. I will record additional lessons in the future, but let's focus now on the exit. You can't hold my word for it. I have an approach for exit slides, which I am not available to recommend you, but I want to say you the reasoning behind it. I often make fun slides as the last slide. This is because after all this tension there was in the presentation and, and all the attention that people have to held during the presentation, a fun slide really releases the body of the viewer. People are always satisfied. They remember this was a good presentation. They value the content, but they still approve having a little, little laugh. From there, it's easier to go to the questions. You make a tensionless fun slide and people are immediately positively influenced by it. And the questions are easier because you don't want to end your presentation, Steve, and say, do you have any questions? And people do not know if you would like to hear those questions or not. Let me show you an example of how to make a fun slide. I copy the title because the front of the and the end can be consistent. And I say, for example, you held true. I take a funny picture, for example, a meme. In this case, I found a with Chuck Norris, which is a GIF. I copy the graphic and I paste it into PowerPoint. And as we can see, PowerPoint is playing GIFs. So I use Chuck this time and I watch the animations. The title is appearing. I also believe Chuck should appear. Okay, people have laughed a little bit and you want everything to fade out. I select anim add animation and I make faded out. I go once again back to the first slide. I copy everything. I go to the last slide and I copy this over. Here I say simply thank you and I write down my name. I make the thank you in the middle. I make those boxes also in the middle. And this is an example of a fun slide, yet it doesn't overstep the professional content. I just select the last animation, make it after previous or even on click. So after I click, the thank you appears and let's preview the slide. This would be pretty funny. As I click, Chuck Norris appears. And as I click once again, because I may see that the audience doesn't like it, I quickly get rid of it and I say a nice thank you. As I told, I can't recommend you to do this. This is only my approach, which I really often do and people always appreciate. University doctors, professional business people, everyone has approved those last slides. As you see, we have arrived to the end of the presentation and I want to thank you very, very much for paying attention and I hope you learned a ton of PowerPoint tricks you didn't know before. So now go ahead and continue with the next section.